And there are Sundays at 10. He, he was in the news this week. Let's find out what that was about. Please welcome Snoop Dogg. Good to see you, buddy. What up, what up, Dr. J? Have you met Arnold before? Yeah, yeah, we was chopping up some green, I mean, some game in the back in the green room. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he could be the next governor. Oh, we. <laughs> I'd love that. You know, it'd be nice, he could give you a pardon. Yes, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> so you have to be nice to him. Man, you're on TV more than I was this week. What, uh, what, what was I, I saw you on the news the other night at the, uh, I played to Kev, I was at the uh, White Entertainment Awards. I didn't get okay. a chance to come by, and I heard there, there was some problems. Is there anything, everything okay? Yeah, everything is beautiful, you know. Yeah. I won an award that night for the best collaboration. <laughs> yeah, okay, okay. But there was, there was some problem with the posse? Um, not that I can recall. <laughs> 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 and you know, I honestly believe you can't recall. Thank you. <laughs> you know, anybody else I go, anybody else, he's lying. No, I believe you don't, can't recall. I can't. All right. But see, you can't talk because you got the lawyer thing going on. Yeah, right. you know Johnny Cochran represents. Now, how was... <laughs> Johnny Cochran. <laughs> how was Doggy Fizzle, Tully Vizzle? I, I, Arnold, say the name of his show. Doggy Vizzle? Television. Television, yes. What's no, not television. No, no, no. <laughs> What's the matter with you? You got the first you half. You can do it. Come on now. Doggy fizzle, television. There you are. Television, okay. Now, it's describe the show. Tell people what it's about. It's a very funny show, it's, comedy show. Yes, yeah, it's, it's just a show basically with me, um, you know, playing a lot of different characters, just having fun and making people smile and laugh, yeah. you know, bringing a good time to TV. Now, who are some of the characters you got? I got a character named Big Jeffrey. I got a character I play called Captain Pimp. Captain Pimp. Uh -huh. Now, Captain Pimp, I heard about. And you have a new one. It's the negotiator guy? What's that? Yeah, the ne negotiator. Ne negotiator. <laughs> yeah, he's called in to uh, negotiate with all of the black crime suspects because he's got a good relationship with them. Oh, I see. All right. <laughs> and you have, and you have, you have guest stars on your show. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Who have you had? Um, Samuel Jackson. Oh, uh, Sam, that's a good one. Yeah. Well, uh, I heard, didn't Joey Buttafuoco do Yeah, Joey Buttafuoco. Y'all look alike. Yeah, really? Yeah. <laughs> now, how were you able to get Joey? I would assume he's so busy. Um, well, you know, me and Joey, you know, we go back like throwbacks. All I had to do yeah. was make the phone call, and he was there for the dog. Oh, all right. Now, we got a piece of tape. You went to the senior center. What's this all about? The you know, everybody always looks out for the young generation. I wanted to look out for the older generation yeah. because that's what inspires me to get old. Yeah. Okay. All right. And, and what, did, what did you do here? Um, I went and hung out at a, um, at a senior citizen's home and just took him out and just had a ball with him. Okay. And, and you got a race going on? Is that what we're going to see? Yeah, the race? we had a little race we had on a little scooter. Race on a scooter. <laughs> all right, let, let, let's take a look from. Uh... Doggy Fizzle. <laughs> <laughs> well, as you see, we're all tuckered up now. Good night, everyone. Good night, sweetheart. It's time to go. Now, what? Explain the wig out segment. Uh, the wig out is when you have uh, basically you got white kids trying to, you know, be black, and their parents don't understand how to get rid of that and make them turn back into the kids that they once was. And that's where I come in and get them back to being who they are. Now, how do you? <laughs> so, how does the wig out process? So, a kid comes in, yo, yo, mom, dad, doing all that. How do you? How does the wig out process work? Well, we have a whole uh, uh, team of agents who come through, yeah. scoop him up, take him to the lab, and get him all the way back right, and get him off barbecue ribs and watch him <laughs> rap. <laughs> <laughs> I see. So it's extensive. It, yeah, it's extensive. Yeah, it's, a, it's a nice treatment, though. Now, you know let me saying? ask you about the about the girls gone wild mm -hmm. videos. Now you're not you, you're breaking off your association with them. Yeah. Okay. Because so. I felt like you know. Wasn't enough soul, you dig? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I liked it, the girls that was on there, but I just needed some more soul, you dig? Yeah, okay, mix it up a bit. Yeah, a little bit. We got Latinos, we got African Americans, we got Asians, we got all kind of nationalities that want to get wild, so I said, why not let them all get wild? I couldn't agree more. <laughs>
Now, now you, have, you have a tape here from a Girls Gone Wild. I, I guess this is more of an educational one? Yes. So, I guess the girls get wild, but with a message? Yes, you always got to have a positive message. Well, let's, let's take a look at Girls Gone Wild with a positive message. That's the most powerful message like that I've ever seen. I mean, if Arnold's gonna run for governor, what's the, what's the next office up under the governor? What would that be? The who? The, the Snoop Dogg office? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, because he gonna need a running mate like me, so I'm just politicking right You could be lieutenant right governor. Here. Yeah, exactly. This should be a good ticket. Oh, yeah, and it's just a rap song. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, the rap song, but I think he's gonna have a difficult time finding a word that rhymes with Schwarzenegger. Well, that's no, true. I won't. <laughs> no, I won't. No, I won't. I bet I won't. But the challenge is on. <laughs> <laughs> now you're a big movie star now? You enjoying that? You like doing the movies? Yeah, I have fun on the movie sets because I get a chance to be a little bit more open and a little yeah. bit more. You know, me, I can bring me to the table. Yeah, well, yeah, you're not open enough. I think that's the problem. Yeah, yeah. 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 Too withdrawn, too shy. Yeah, they got to explore now, me a little bit more. Are you doing a new, are they doing a new airplane? Like, is this like the airplane movie? Yeah, it's called did? Soul Plane. Soul Plane. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You and know. who are you? Are you the pilot? Yeah, I'm the pilot. I'm the one who's driving. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you never forget who's driving. <laughs> I'm gonna yep. get us there, too. You ever been on a bad flight, uh, oh, for real? Oh, yeah, man. I was on a bad flight uh, going to Baton Rouge, Louisiana, and it dropped, like, about 10,000 feet. And we was on one of them planes with the, um, with the wooden propellers. <laughs> what, what was this, 1942 you went there? <laughs> plane with wooden propellers? What are you talking about? I mean, they didn't it? tell us that until we got in the air. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if you look out the window, you can see the big propellers. <laughs> You're right. Maybe, <laughs> maybe I was high before I went and got You think high. that's it? <laughs> <laughs> now, I gotta ask you about Starsky and Huck. This looks really funny. This is, this is uh, Ben Stiller, Owen Wilson, and you as yes, Huggy sir. Bear. Uh -huh. You're doing the Starsky and Hutch movie. I guess there's some People magazine. Take a look at this picture. That's a hilarious picture. It look, looks very funny. That's why I'm wearing these glasses tonight to let everybody got know. the Huggy Bear movie. Huggy Bear's coming to your town. Well, Huggy very Bear. cool. Well, listen, congratulations. Doggy Fizzle, Telly Fizzle. For Shizzle Fizzle. For Shizzle. There you go. Snoop, thank you, buddy. All righty, be right back with Blue Cantel right after this.